She took this money and said, boy, you right. Although Joe Biden has ended the 20-year war in Afghanistan and allowed 95,000 immigrants to come over here and actually give them a free ticket on their way, it seems to me that the black Haitian migrants that are trying to cross over here in Del Rio, Texas, are being denied their rights to enter the United States. They are fleeing natural disasters. They are fleeing a pandemic and their president was just assassinated. I'm a little bit confused at why Border Patrol agents are able to use whips or reins in order to keep them in line. I'm a little bit confused at what's going on here. The whole point of Border Patrol and the police was a part of the slave patrol, but not to keep them out, simply to keep the enslaved workers in. Now we're doing the opposite to the first people who were ever freed and freed from this country. I'm a little bit confused at what's going here and I need some answers. It seems to me also that Johnson & Johnson is trying to push for a second shot saying that it would increase by 94% effectancy. Also, the Pfizer is trying to get a third booster shot round. I'm a little bit confused if the first shot, second shot, third shot works or if you guys are just testing this out. This is the Sticky Icky Truth and I'm here to bring it to you. Uh, let's filter it out, people. So, the Haitian border was crazy, but the Mexican border was even more nutty. Coming into America is even more nuttier. Why? Because you see it. You've seen all of it. You've seen all of these people there, the whips coming out, these cats trying to keep these people rounded up. It was, it's horrible. It looked horrible. I'm not, I'm not even putting extras on on the newspaper this is literally what was going on i mean wh what is you know primarily going on um even with the whole vaccine shot i'm not like you know what i mean i'm not praising it i'm not trying to depraise it you know it's, it's people are surviving from it people are getting help from it people need it you know so i'm Send them blessings, you know, to the others. They have their own thinking. They have their own way of thinking of that. The Gas Mask Tribe is literally here to, for you to have a different perspective, for you to go out and seek the information on why these things are, are occurring and to see if, you know, you're the best person to be able to uh, take on certain things, you know. Um, so I don't want to, you know, influence anyone to um, do what their heart doesn't tell them. You know, your heart tells you what to do. Um, and I get it. We love Biden. Some people hate Biden. Um, I'm not a big, a huge fan. My, me, uh, me for, you know, I, I'm not a huge fan. Uh, I'm not a huge fan of Kamala. But, hey, it is what it is. We are in the world we are in, and it's our job to just make it better. And you can sit around and mope all day and talk and be, you know, um, you know, be unproactive in things and you could just be a gossiper and do shit and just be a person that's, to me, that's a person that really is just full of bullshit, you know? Right here is where we filter it out. That's the reason why you clicked on this video, to hear some filtered out shit. Understand, it's, life is what you make it and you cannot receive more than what you put in like if you put in five dollars you go get five dollars so i'm <laughs> it, it is what it is people gas man stripe tv podcast we filter out that bull if you didn't like what i said if you didn't like what was going on and you want to filter out the bs let's go comment below where we at we go live on fridays and i would love for you to tune in all right yeah gas man stripe oh.